Hi everyone, welcome back to the my channel. My name is Anil and in this angular video tutorial we will learn about the pipes. What are the pipes, how we can use it, everything. So these are the points of the video. We will see what is the pipes as in the theoretical part. Then uh, we will use the pipe with the string, date, slice, currency and many more. And uh, we will see the examples with everything, right? So that you will just get the uh, idea about uh, how many ways we have with the strings, right? So the question is, what is the pipe? Basically, pipe is used for change the format. Uh, like you just want to change the format for string. You want to change the format for date. And uh, uh, let's say you just want to, uh, you have a string and you just want to slice the string from starting and from the end with the specific characters and you just want to define a USD dollar currency and all that time the pipes are very useful and they are lots of pipe which is predefined by the uh, angular right so now let's start with the string then we will see the date and all right so uh, let's say uh, we have a name like Peter like uh, Peter Parker and you just want to show this name uh, first of all let's show it in a simple way so that we will just get it step by step right so we just put her name and uh, you will see that we got a Peter Parker name but now we have a requirement that we just want to completely it in the capital uh, capital case right so now you have the two options one is you can just write your manual function and update it in the capital case but or uppercase and uh, second thing is you can use the pipes which is provided by the angler and are pretty easy, easy to use for that you just have to use this pipe and uh, just simply write here uppercase right and now you will see that the name is converted in the uppercase same thing you can also use like uh, uh, title case and in the title case it will just uh, convert the first letters in the capital case right here you can see the second one we just write here and let's say you just want to have some uh, different kind of uh, string like k and er capital already and you just want to make in the lower case also right then you can just put it lower case oh my bad right and now you can see that we have a perfect example for every string right so uh, now let's move with the date so we just want to print the date for today so we have a property the name of today and it have a date dot now value right okay okay we have to use it equal to and now let's try to print it and it will just uh, provide us a timestamp right just put here today and you will find there is a timestamp which is cannot be read easily right so here we can also use the pipes with the lots of way so first of all let's use the pipe in a normal way like this right and it will just convert the in a date in a normal way right July 14 and 2020 that's okay um, now let's say you just want a date in a full flash uh, with the day date and all so just you can use here colon full date right and now you will see that it date will come with the date and complete J U L I complete spell and all right so that's also great so now uh, let's take one more case we have a string and we just want to cut this string from starting and from the end right so let's say I have a str and it have value hello angular and all right so let's uh, just show this string for a moment like str and uh, now we will find that this is okay so just comment it out some uh, upper things so now you can see that hello angular is perfect word but now you just want to cut down the two words right then you can just simply use here slice and uh, with the slice colon and where you just want to string with the index so let's say i just want to cut it from the position two then you will find that it will just uh, 
cut the index 0 and 1 and it will just working from the 2 and let's say you just want to cut down from the end also then you can again use like 6 then uh, it will just show the string from uh, second index to the sixth index like this right so this is the way that how we can use a slash also and uh, there is one more very important uh, uh, pipes about the currency change right so let's say I have a uh, money right right and it have like hundred and I don't know what is the hundred is that it's a rupees and uh, dollar and US dollar and Canadian dollar but I don't know right so now let's print it here like money right and you will find here like hundred but uh, now you got that this is in the uh, US dollar so that you can just simply use here pipe currency and then use the colon and just put here USD United States dollar and uh, you can find there in the proper way so now let's say you just want to convert this currency in the Canadian dollar so just write here CAD right and again you will find this uh, the Canadian uh, dollar symbol right so uh, these symbols are not provided for the every countries you barely find these uh, symbols for Indian currency and all but uh, most of the time they are still useful so thanks for watching this video if you still have any kind of question related to the angular related to the uh, pipe then you can ask me in the comment box don't forget to subscribe my channel and like this video